You know, in India, the, the bourgeois society, the middle class or upper middle class, we have very few professions. Yeah. Yeah. There is, it would seem to me being a conductor is a great job because you've got the whole creative thing about music. You're also part of building something, which is a, an orchestra and making it come together. You're part general in a sense. You've got lots of things that you bring in together. Uh, you've got to be an interpreter. You've got to be a teacher. I mean, it calls on about every skill that a human being needs. Uh, it's a it, composite of so many dimensions, as you've very well put, I must say. Yes. Uh, that's why, on the surface, it's a very simple profession. And yet, you have so few really great conductors. Why is that? And that's the enigma. Because there's something mystical about it, no doubt. On the surface, it's some, see, it is very simple. Yeah. And yet, you say you have to build. But you not only have to build your orchestra, concert after concert, but you also have to build the masterpieces you're interpreting. Yeah. You have 115 odd thinking minds in front of you. Yeah. They have opinions, they are very fine musicians, they have thought about what they are doing, and you have to convince all of them in a cohesive manner. Well, they don't dare rebel against a conductor, do they? No, but they dare tell you their opinions. <laughs> <laughs> and, and my door is open yeah. uh, for suggestions. And it happens, I mean, I'm going now to, to a rehearsal. Yeah. I will have suggestions. Yeah. For this evening's concert. You'll have for suggestions. Sure. From, for sure. Somebody will come in and say... Very respectfully, I don't agree with you. <laughs> <laughs> now, what would they disagree with? Give me an example of something that a, that a member of the orchestra might disagree what, with. For instance, he might say, look, at the last concert where you played the same, uh, we're on yeah. tour now, uh, this particular part you, you sort of took so fast, I can't play the notes. That's a practical suggestion. Yeah, right, right. Then, yeah, you took it so fast, meaning you just came... Well, by that, because by that time that we, we, we sort of interpreting the symphony, we come to a part where the momentum, the adrenaline is such yeah. that it does get a little bit faster than you want it. Right. Let's say. Of, it's almost like a galloping horse that is taking on. Yes, it's six galloping yeah. horses <laughs> that you have to control. Uh, yeah. And sometimes you have to let them run themselves. Yeah. And sometimes they run away. Yeah. And uh, your job is when to interfere, when to give them that right rhythmic impulse, when to prepare a person for what is going to happen, uh, the contact between conductor and the, uh, f the leading um, uh, members of the, of the string section, the first stands, you know, that, that you sort of have constant eye contact with. Yeah. You have to prepare them. Now, now I want this s attack that's coming up, a soft attack, a hard attack, which is, of course, also formulated at rehearsals. But a lot happens at concerts, a lot. It does. Yes. In, in the, the dynamic of the moment. Because you're interpreting at the moment. You've set, you've set your rules. Your cards are all on the table. Yeah. But then you are really interpreting at the moment. And you're also letting your colleagues interpret. And the interpretation is based on what you are, sh what the sound you're sharing at the moment. Or, or the point of construction you are in the, in the, in the symphony. Uh. Because the symphony has a form. Right. Every movement, whether it's what we call a sonata form, or you have a minuet, or you have a lead form, these are different forms. These are different musical structures. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the conductor has to have in mind the shape of the structure, especially when you get into a, a major Mahler symphony, which is an extended form, or a tone poem of Strauss, or a Wagner opera, which in that sense has no structure. Yeah. Which has, the structure comes from the drama on stage.